We get a lot of calls from people asking us how to start a freight brokerage business in Canada or US. In today's video, I will talk about freight brokerage licensing requirements including freight brokerage surety bond if you want to start your own freight or load brokerage business in Canada or US. Hello everyone, my name is Kamal and I'm the founder and one of the lead instructors at Tracadium. Starting your own freight or load brokerage business can be a lucrative opportunity for those seeking financial independence, autonomy and the flexibility to work from anywhere in the world. However, it requires an entrepreneurial mindset, excellent sales skills, problem solving abilities and outstanding relationship building skills to succeed as a freight broker. The first step towards establishing a freight brokerage is to register your business. In Canada, incorporation of your business is typically the starting point. In the US, registering an LLC is the norm. You can either do it yourself or take the help of a third party service provider, which can cost a few hundred dollars. For tax purposes, you will also need to register for a GST, HST or EIN number based on your business operations. Aside from business registration, you must also obtain the necessary insurance coverage such as contingent cargo coverage, general liability and errors and omission insurance. Insurance cost may vary based on the coverage amount. I will get into more details on freight brokerage insurance requirements in a separate video as well. In most Canadian provinces, freight brokerage is largely deregulated and no freight brokerage license is required. Province of Quebec though is an exception. If you intend to conduct business with Quebec or register your company in Quebec, you must register with CTQ as a transport service intermediary, which costs around 153 Canadian dollars annually. However, in the US, freight brokerage industry is very regulated. If you're a Canadian company interested in brokering freight in the US, or if you are a US based freight brokerage business, you must also apply for an MC DOT number as a freight broker. A one-time fee of 300 US dollars is required and FMCSA which is Federal Motor Carrier Safety Administration will issue the MCDOT number. Additionally, you must file BOC3 which is a designation of agents for the service of process. This implies that you must have a process agent in each state where you broker freight to accept legal documents on behalf of your freight brokerage company. There is a one-time fees associated with BOC3 filing. Freight brokers must now pay UCR, which is Unified Carrier Registration Fees as well, which typically must be paid once a year. Finally, the most important requirement for brokering freight in the US as a Canadian or US based freight brokerage business is a 75,000 USD surety bond. FMCSA requires this to protect carrier companies if a licensed freight broker fails to pay them after delivering the load. In the event of non-payment by the freight broker, the carrier company may file a payment claim against this bond. Now to meet this requirement, either you can file BMC 84, which is a type of surety bond or BMC 85, which is a type of a trust fund. Most new freight brokers opt for the BMC 84, which is a lower cost option where a third party bond company files this 75,000 US dollar bond with the FMCSA and you pay an annual premium to the bond company as a freight broker. Although the premium may vary from 1-12% to 12 depending on your business history and credit score, most new freight brokers typically pay on an average 3-4% to 4 of US dollars as a one-time annual payment for BMC 84 filing. To summarize, if you want to establish a freight brokerage business in Canada or the US, you should start by registering your business or forming an LLC if you're in the US, get your GST, HST or EIN number depending on your business operations, obtain your MCDOT number and a surety bond of 75,000 US dollars, complete your BOC3 filing and UCR registration and speak with a few insurance brokers to obtain the required insurance coverage. If you're looking to start a freight or load brokerage business in Canada or US, we can also help you get all the required licenses including MCDOT number and surety bond. We charge a very nominal fees and can also provide a very competitive rate for the surety bond. I hope you like this video. Please like and share this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more such informational videos about trucking and logistics.